بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ترجمانا نمسل تربيل لان رجاء وكسان سي بموك و حواد يرغل کرده و امريكايان دي حواد پا اشغال كي مرست كي كومك كي و دي موك دي موك مكلفيت لرو دي وميلات و حيث تخبل لحريم ندفاع وكو There is no future in Afghanistan as an interpreter But that's our life, I have no choice don't you understand? These people's lives are in danger as we speak. They've been marked for death. They're going to die. They're going to be killed. When I started working with the U.S. Army, I was trying to help them to help us. Things would have been a lot worse if we didn't have interpreters working for us. And Philip was the best one I've ever came across. I told him, you do new leave, what's going to happen to me? These Iraqis who supported and trusted us most now feel abandoned by us. I have been waiting for my visa almost four years. My case has never moved, you know? It's always in the same situation. Maybe I am be killed or one of my kids. So I decided to leave. The bad thing happened, the, the boat was overloaded. I pray to God, pray to Allah that hopefully when they kick it some good news from the U.S. Embassy site. The latter order temporarily halts the flow of refugees in Seattle. They need us to be better than we are. All I hope for them is to get out. I don't imagine they are going to stay and build the new Afghanistan or the new Iraq. They need to get somewhere safe.